that boy future hendrix is back on asap ferg's new song allure and future has a message to the people that flipped on his brother young thug fair lyrical miracle breakdown future said 100 killers when i'm in a city like they want my head i'm just a street nigga that's just rapping my day ones went fed you took a plea on my slime won't be surprised if you end up dead and later in the verse future says then took a plea out on your cody got you killed like that you claim you sliming niggas out like that you ain't built like that you signed a statement you ain't my twin why you cap like that a lot of people believe that verse may be in the direction of Gunna, an artist that Future had made a lot of music with. And some people did call Twin back in the day, uh, Future and Gunna at their apex. But uh, if that is about Gunna, I, I don't think Future is one of these guys that's going to allow Gunna back in his circle. He lives by a code and he believes Gunna broke that code, um, agreeing to a plea deal in the YSL case. I'm assuming Future's talking about that. He was clearly talking about Young Thug. But the, the assumption out there that's growing online is uh, Future continues to not be happy with anybody that took a plea against Thug, especially somebody he worked with. She's Louise, man. You know, Future continues to have moment after moment in hip hop. Year after year, Future just refuses to go away. This dude continues to age his prime out later and later. And Wale believes we at the point now where Future needs to be considered one of the rap goats of all time. He recently tweeted out that Future's influence on the culture is not a debate and that Future has put himself in the conversation of top 10 hip hop artists of all time. Y'all let me know your thoughts on Wale, who's a great lyricist himself. Some would say Wale is one of the best lyricists of this generation of all time. And for him to give the nod to Future tells you how highly Wale thinks of Future. Do you believe with Future's influence, with the way he's held down, a lot of the women love Future, the streets have always loved Future. Although he may not be looked at as lyrical miracle like a Kendrick or Drake or a Cole of this generation, but because Future has catered to his base, and kept a cool image some would argue future has aged better than some of those artists previously named wale clearly believes that future is one of those dudes for this generation let me know your thoughts when wale talks hip-hop i listen this is a, an astute historian of of the sport called hip-hop like i don't think he put that out there for no reason does future have a legit top 10 all-time claim and obviously it's hip-hop is subjective there are going to be people out there that say, hell no, that'll never leave uh, uh, an LL Cool J, a uh, Jay-Z, a uh, Nas out of their prime. There are some people that would never leave a Lil Wayne, a uh, Drake out of their prime. There are going to be people who say, yo, my prime has future in it. My top 10 has got to have future in it. I want to know your thoughts, though. This is your palette. What you like in music. Future's got a new verse. He's hot again. New project out in the atmosphere. It went number one again. Let me know your thoughts on Future. I'm out. All right, y'all. The NFL season is here. Head over to Underdog Fantasy. Use my promo code, Pharaoh. You can already make your picks for the entire season. Here are some guys that I believe are going to have great years. If your picks are correct, you're going to win a lot of cheese. Use my promo code, Pharaoh. Tell me when you did it. I might even give you a free copy of Madden 25 or NCAA College Football 25.